one thing about having an all-glass front is that it changes the elements of iPhone design that we are all used to. If you were to sketch an iPhone it would be easily recognizable from the circular home button at the bottom. The iPhone X changes that. Now if someone sees you with an iPhone X they will know it's an iPhone when they see the interface, but predominantly it will become recognizable from the notch, the name that everyone has assigned to the area at the top of the front of the iPhone that houses the Face ID technology and associated camera. There's an infrared camera, flood illuminator, and dot projector as seen below. It's amusing that the notch, which many decried when the iPhone X was announced, has become its most distinct feature. The thing that everyone will recognize and that will say this is an iPhone. The alternative to the notch is that you have a 7mm bezel at the top but instead, Apple is able to utilize the ears either side which we think is a much more elegant way to do things. The notch isn't there just to annoy us, though, its presence is due to all the technology that goes into Face ID. A closer look will reveal an infrared camera, flood illuminator, and dot projector, as seen here. iPhone X Review, Design With no home button, the screen is able to extend all the way from the top to the bottom of the iPhone, eliminating any real bezel. It means the display is the largest ever on an iPhone in a handset physically smaller than the plus-sized iPhones, despite the iPhone being only a shade larger than the iPhone 8. Despite this huge change, the X is still IP67 waterproof rated. Otherwise the familiar in hand feel and curved corners remain with silent switch and volume buttons on the left hand side, and a larger power, lock button, now referred to as the side button by Apple, on the right above the SIM tray. This side button replaces a lot of the functionality of the home button. Turning the iPhone X over, the rear cameras are aligned vertically instead of horizontally, which apparently is better for R because those apps tend to be held in landscape, another thing we will discuss below. They stick out a fraction further than the camera on the back of the iPhone 8 Plus, which may be due to the addition of optical image stabilization on the wide lens camera, more on the camera below too.